Jordan and today we'll be rigging an eye I made. So let's get started. Okay, here I have a face I made. So I'm going to go select the eye and go object, set origin and origin to the geometry first. Object, set origin, and origin geometry. Good. Now I'm going to go add mesh plane. And I'm going to go G1. I'm going to click H now. Okay. Now I'm going to go add an armature. I'm going to go GY and go X. Actually, I'm going to go X, select my eye, go shift S, and cursor to be selected. Now I'm going to go add armature and go GY. Now I'm going to go select my other eye, go shift S, cursor to be selected. Now I'm going to go add an armature. Now I'm going to select this armature, armature, and on the Y axis, I'm going to go Command C and select my other bone. On the Y axis, delete Command V, enter. There. Now they're both at the same location on the Y axis. Good. Now I'm going to go to my bone properties and go Viewport Display. And I'm going to select, go to my custom properties and go plane. Now it looks like a plane, but actually it's still an armature, it's still a bone. Good. I'm going to go on wireframe, go on the y axis and go S to scale. Good. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go scale and command C to copy. Okay, go on my other bone, this bone, and do the same thing. Go on my plane, go wireframe, and I'm going to go on my scale, and I'm going to select one, but drag it down to select all the others. Now I'm going to delete, command V, and enter. There. Okay, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to select my and I'm going to go um, to my um, object constant properties. Okay, I'm going to select that and go copy rotation. And the target, I'm going to select the little eyedropper and go object armature. Good. Now, if I go Rx, we rigged it, which is really cool. Go RZ, even if you go R, it will rotate it anywhere you want it to, which is really good. Okay, now I'm going to do the same thing to the other arm. Go select that, go add object constraints, and go copy rotation. Oh, actually, I'm going to come on and say, come on, say, come on, say. Oh, I have to select that. My eye, add object constraint, and copy rotation. Then I'm going to go to my target and select object armature dot zero zero one. Good. Now it's cool, but it would be nice for a way to rotate the both eyes at the same time. Which you can do by selecting one of my armatures, one of my armatures, 0.001, and select holding down shift to select that other, go R. It's nice, but there's an easier way to do that. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go on the y axis, select one of my armatures, and I'm going to go add mesh. I'm going to select my armature, go shift D, go GX, and I'm 
around there. And I'm going to go on the y-axis, go S to scale, go SX, there. Now I'm going to select one of my armatures, go hold down shift, select the other, and carry on holding down shift and select the biggest one, the last. Now I'm going to go command T to select parents to object. Now if I select my big one and go RX, it will rotate on the X. And if I select this one, Rx, I can rotate by itself. This is the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Bye.